All right, movie guys, welcome back. We're here with Vic Blockbuster, and we're going to show you some of the stock that I have here that I have for quite a while. Some of them are open, you know, because we've been going through them, and they've been with me for quite a while. And uh, I'm just going to go through one at a time to show you what we have and how much of it that we got. And as you can see, we just keep going down the line. And they're in pretty much in order. And not only that I collect most of my movies here, my son, Jose, also does his collection and we share the stock here. I know it's a little dark down there, but we'll get a little closer look so you can get an idea of what we're talking about here. I want to show you some of them that we have that, you know, that are open, not only just sealed because I do have plenty of seal one but you can see I have Buzz, Woody, Bullseye and Bullseye there's my boy and just to show you that we have the both of them over here of the VHS is here you have the VHS 1 and 2 and to show you that you know it's all you know intact together this is when uh, Buzz and Woody met each other for the first time and we get to see Bullseye on the second one. And Jesse. Don't forget Jesse. Oh, Jesse will follow. There's the uh, tape itself. I tell you, we try to keep them nice and tacked. We keep them together. Try not to harm these movies as we go along. Mm -hmm. All right. Let me show you a bonus pack over here. Here's Jumanji. All right. With Robin Williams. This one is a definitely a classic. As you can see, the tape inside. Even though we watch it a lot on TV, but sometimes when there's nothing on TV to watch, we go ahead and throw the movie in the cassette. Boom, and we watch it. Not only that we had the Jumanji movie, the VHS, we went out and got the Jumanji game. And as you can see, this game is very valuable to me, you know, to us. It's not open. We didn't want it open. We want to try to keep it sealed just to show proof of it that it's never been open. And, you know, I was curious because I figured, is that really true that it can really happen if you play the Jumanji game? I think this game is, is one almost, to me, like a Luigi board. Once you start playing, you can't put it down. All right, that... That was almost like our bonus features right there because not only that we just collect movies, we collect some of the items that's on here too. But we want to show you a few of them over here, which I'm going to probably get help with my son that uh, he knows more about the animation because he does animation on his own. You can look it up on Jose Maldonado. Yep, uh, link is going to be in the description and all that. There you go. So, I mean, you know, he loves some of these movies. And just tell me which one you to pull out, and then we can go ahead and talk about it. You can talk about uh, ants. It's up there. And the ants. We have two of them here. We have the first cover and the original cover. The original cover we had to go find because this is actually the movie cover itself. So, go ahead and explain to the viewers. Ants came out in 1998 in theaters, and it wasn't released on home video until 1999. So, I mean, I first saw this movie in 2010. I never got around with it, but I watched it a couple years later. I just love this movie. Absolutely, and I'm telling you, he's, he's a fan of Ants, definitely. He's definitely a fan of Ants. I'm going to grab another one over here because he's, he, he collects all these animation, and he's, he's so proud of it. Let me show you one over here, which is Shrek. Be careful with Shrek. It's one of those boxes case. Now, we went and got this one for, and we had this for quite a while. Go ahead and explain to him about this one. Oh, Shrek. You can't go wrong with Shrek. Mike Myers and Eddie Murphy. You just gotta love that movie. And the, and the movie is 20 years old now. Definitely. And that's it. I mean, we got all that... Not a, oh, be careful with it. Uh, <laughs> Those yeah, right. horrible bot case they uh, did for that one. We also got Space Jam, which the new movie came out, Space Jam came out, but the original we always wanted to get around, so. 
Go ahead and explain about that one. The original Space Jam. I was not even around when that came out. 1996. And you can see the VHS tape is still in there. Nice cover. We try to keep everything, you know, neat and clean and safe by And the new one will be pr getting pretty soon anyways, the new one. And to show you some more, I want to show you my YouTube logo and all oh my icon. I'm a towering inferno person. Always loved this movie. I went to go see it in 1974 for the first time with my mom. And ever since this movie came out, I snuck out of school just so I can go see this movie again. You can see, this is one movie that I'll never trade over. I see it on TV, and when I don't see it on TV, I just put it inside the cassette, and there I am, I'm playing it. Steve McQueen and Paul Newman, these are one of the best actors today. Here's one over here, The Poseidon Adventure. You have a variety of stars over here. The case is up. Oh, I have it upside down. Sorry, fan. <laughs> um, you can see that the Poseidon event of the tape is still intact with the case and everything. I hope to find one seal because I want to try to keep it perfect and keep it in stock. But it has to have the original cover when I find it. We're going to let that one sit over here. I'm a Rambo fan. Love Sylvester Stallone. Even when he did his movie Rocky. I have the cassette over here of all his Rambos from 1, 2, and 3. I hope to find it, you know, all sealed so I could keep them all intact. But just to show you, you got all three. You got Rambo 1, 2, and 3. First Blood was his first one, as you can see. That was the first one. And the second one to go was Rambo. Now, this movie, I went to go see it at the drive-in. And you know what? It was more exciting at the drive-in than it was in the theater. And the third one was also the drive-in. Good movies. Good movies. But it's a shame that they stopped doing the VHSs. So I went out and got the last two Rambos. I got Rambo 4 and 5. His last one, which is Last Blood. Good movie. I was so excited to see it. Lots of action. When it comes to Sylvester Stallone, he's the one you want to see. Okay, moving right along. I want to show you something here. This is a collection that uh, Jose does, you know, because he's a SpongeBob fan, just like I was. And when I started watching SpongeBob, he was the biggest fan right after that. We're also in the fan club together mm -hmm. on this part. But I'm going to show you the Spongebob movie that came out recently. And I'm going to have him explain it to you. This movie came out in 2004. And I just love this movie. As you can see, it's all in, you know, intact. And like we always say, we try to keep it nice and sealed. So this way, you know, it doesn't, you know, get damages or any, as we go. Well, that's just the movie. Not just the movie. I love the show itself. The first episode he saw was the one where he first met Sandy. And you can see, not only that we got the movie, we also got the collection with it. We're Spongebob fans, so we have to have something to keep it, make it keep laughing with us. Spongebob's been my favorite. But I want to go into the next one we got over here. We got Monsters, Inc. And like I said, we are collecting of not only just the VHSs or the DVD movies... We also have all the character that comes with it. And if you can see, if I get a little closer there, you'll see Sully, Mike Patalski, the, the kid, and uh, Randall. And Randall. Well, at least that, thank goodness I have Jose with me. And as you can see, we also have the Monster Zinc uh, VHS. Explain to them about this one. Uh, Monster Zinc, well... It came out in 2001, wasn't released on video till 2002. And as you can see, it comes with this blue tape. And as you can see in the inside, inside of the tape, which we might not take it out, it shows all the characters inside there. Oh, we can do that real quick. We can quick. do that. And there it is. Look at that. That's a treasure right there. Just to see all those characters and the signature at the same time. 
I bet that's the only uh, Disney VHS that has something like that. I think. So with that, we like I said, we are collectors. You know, not only just VHSs and DVDs, we collect most of the uh, items that goes with it because we want to show the viewers what that what we love most and and most of the movies that we see. All right, and moving right along, I am a Charlie Brown's fan. I always been when I was young, and now I passed all my laughter to my son Jose. And not only that, we watched it on TV. We went out and we bought the VHSs just so we can watch it every season. So every time the holiday comes, we wind up playing that on there so it could be more a tradition to us. You got the Easter Beagle with Charlie Brown, mm -hmm. which is all tacked over here. And, oops, here we go. Careful. Yeah. yeah. You can see the VHS is inside. Okay. Then to the next season, we got the Great Pumpkin. And you can see that's where, you know, Charlie Brown line is and his beagle, Snoopy. And, and, and you this can see, was the uh, first Charlie Brown special I ever saw. There you go. First one I ever saw. So, we got the Great Pumpkin. Moving right along to Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving Charlie Brown. And as you can see, that one's all put together inside. Remember, we keep all our movies... Well, you know, taking care. We don't want to ruin any of it. We keep them up in the shelf. And last but not least, Christmas with Charlie Brown. Now this one, I tell you, every time I see this one, I get goosebumps. You know, because I love the ending. And you can see, it's right inside. But we also got a, a bonus feature with this one. We went out to search and we found... Snoopy. The Snoopy. And uh, Woodstock. With Woodstock. Now, if you squeeze his paws right here, you get to hear this. Well, anyway, we're going to leave it at that. We're going to be back again to show you some more of our exciting videos and more adventures. Because we got wall to walls VHSs all over the place and DVDs, Blu ray. We're, don't forget the Blu rays. We still got some of those to show. So, I'm um, Vic at Blockbuster. Please give a like, subscribe, and we'll see you soon.